This is all wrong. I shouldn't be up here. I should be back in school on the other side of the ocean. Yet you all come to us young people for hope. How dare you? You have stolen my dreams and my childhood with your empty words. And yet I'm one of the lucky ones. People are suffering. People are dying. Entire ecosystems are collapsing. We are in the beginning of a mass extinction, and all you can talk about is money and fairy tales of eternal economic growth. How dare you? To all the school kids going on strike for climate change, you're the first generation who've required air conditioning in every classroom. You want TV in every room, and your classes are all computerized. You spend all day and night on electronic devices. More than ever, you don't walk or ride bikes to school, but you arrive in caravans of private cars that choke suburban roads and worsen rush hour traffic. You're the biggest consumers of manufactured goods ever and update perfectly good, expensive luxury items to stay trendy. Your entertainment comes from electric devices. Furthermore, the people driving your protests are the same people who insist on artificially inflating the population growth through immigration which increases the need for energy, manufacturing and transport. The more people we have, the more forest and bushland we clear. The more of the environment that's destroyed. How about this? Tell your teachers to switch off the aircon. Walk or ride to school. Switch off your devices and read a book. Make a sandwich instead of buying manufactured fast food. No, none of this will happen. Because, the piece says, you're selfish, badly educated, virtue-signalling little turds inspired by the adults around you who crave a feeling of having a noble cause while they indulge themselves in Western luxury and unprecedented quality of life. Wake up, grow up and shut up.